Когда бойцы обладают большим опытом, мастерством и огромным желанием победить, то бой между ними может превратиться в настоящее шоу с обоюдными шансами на успех. Но, честно говоря, я не могу припомнить еще одного боя с таким же количеством попыток удушающих приемов, как тот, что мы сегодня с вами посмотрим. Если же вы, дорогие друзья, сможете припомнить что-то подобное, то, пожалуйста, обязательно напишите об этом в комментариях. В декабре 2016 года в Назране проходил международный турнир M1 73 «Битва нартов». Первым в рейдж вышел английский боец Кристиан Холли по прозвищу The Animal. За его плечами было 10 побед в 12 профессиональных поединках, а среди побежденных им был даже Артем Лобов. Также он являлся чемпионом Англии по смешанным боевым единоборствам. Его соперником стал один из сильнейших бойцов республики Ингушетия, Хамзат Далгиев. Он шел на победной серии 7 боев подряд и уверенно поднимался в рейтингах. В его активе была также бронза Кубка мира по боевому самбо и звание мастера спорта под дзюдо. Для Хамзата бой против Кристиана стал очень серьезным вызовом и проверкой собственных сил на глазах у родных зрителей. Для англичанина же дебютный бой в Мвар Глобал являлся большим шансом доказать свой высокий класс. M1 Global presents... Хамза Долгиев, представляю клуб RZ. Друз у нас здесь дома, в Бушете. С одной стороны, я бьюс дома. Это э, должно было мне как-нибудь бодрить. Ну, как сказать, биться на родном земле, это для меня. Волнительно, волнуюсь, переживаю. Я готовился здесь, дома, в своем родном клубе, под руководством своего тренера и своих друзей. Можно сказать, готов на 100%. И попытаюсь показать хороший бой. Yeah, well, it's um, it's my first visit to Russia, so it's uh, it's cool. You know, I'm I'm uh, nice in the country, and uh, it's good to fight here. Um, yeah, and I expect to see uh, to see my opponent do his best, so I can bring out my best. Yeah, well, um, being a local guy, you know, I suppose he's going to have lots of support from the audience, but I've fought many times abroad, so I'm used to having um, people uh, fighting that have a, a big support, so I'm just coming here to do my job, get the win and go back home. Соперник мой Кристиан Холл, хороший, стойкий, в партии тоже. Можно сказать, ветеран своего дела не первый раз дерется на таким масштабном турнире, как М1. Это у него здесь в России дебют. Но я со своей стороны попытаюсь показать гостеприимство. Буду биться до конца. Волнуюсь, нервничаю, чувствую ответственность перед, перед земляками, перед родными, перед головой. I reckon he's, you know, he's got a, for me, I think he's got a sloppy style, he's a, possibly Sambo, you know, so. He's, um, he's tall, he's got maybe a little bit of range, but I'm going to get stuck in, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to get the dog. No, in the city of sport, I'll try to do all my friends and friends. I'm going to do Кристиан, в этом бою у меня нет пути назад, только вперед. Christian Holly in the black trunks looking to take on the local hero. Comes out Dalgiev. 
in this lightweight bout tonight. Well, Hurley comes out with an impressive record of 10 and 1. He's beaten some big names up there as well, Mark. Yeah, he has beaten Artem Lobov, the teammate of Conor McGregor. That obviously a big feather in his cap. And you can see here why he moves very good. Always lands that stiff jab and now goes for the nice. takedown, gets it. Good work though by Dalgier, gets straight back to his feet. Making it hard work for Holly. Yeah, Holly relentless working on this takedown. Went for the ankle pick, didn't get it. But good defense by Dalgev, who fights in front of his home crowd, and he said in his little teaser video before the fight, on one hand, it's good to have the support from his home fans, but on the other hand, it's a lot more pressure on his shoulders, but he is used to fighting in Inga Shitja. Well, someone's bleeding, Mark. I can see blood on the forearm of Dalgiev. I think it's coming from the nose of Holly. It is. Well, again, scrambling to the canvas, then back to his feet as Dalgiev. Dalgiev on a seven-fight win streak. Well-rounded guy, combat sample background, but now... Now he takes the back. Oh! Holly gets the back. He's sinking in the rear naked choke, this could be it. He's in an awkward position, he traps the arm when he goes for the hook. And remember, he's a national BJJ champion. Oh, Four this times. is tight. Can he finish the fight here? Out, he's trying to come out the back door, switches us to it, to he's, a triangle. The crowd go crazy. Great transition by the Brit here. Gonna switch to an armbar now. Went from rear naked choke the triangle, tried it, but missed it. Delvia showed big heart, escape from the... Submission now go for guilty himself here. Well, it's safe now. He's inside control, very, very hard. If not, only impossible to put on a guillotine from side control. But again, taking the back position is Holly. What a fight! Getting the rear naked choke again from side control. Crowd is on their feet here as their you local can, hero. You can, you can tap somebody out from this position. It's very tight. He was close to tapping oh, he's out going here. Red. He's going very red. Can Christian Holly finish the oh, local what hero? An now. Escape, beautiful work. What a fight! Dalgiev takes his back now. Now Dalgiev working Holly from behind. Wow! But Holly, a seasoned veteran, fought on the big stage in the past, knows how to defend in that position. But Dalgiev, relentless. Referee warning Holly for holding or trying to hold the rope. He's going to get a, he's going he to get a point it again. deducted. He's going to get a point deducted. He doesn't need this. Yellow card for Holly. That means a point deduction and a 20% deduction of his fight purse for repeatedly grabbing the ropes. You know, sometimes when you sort of get pulled backwards, you reach out to grab something. I mean, I'm a fighter myself. I've been there. It's not, it's not intentional, but you kind of do it. And he did it again, Ian. Took a knee on the way in as well. Dalgiev now dominant position here. Trout and Ingushitia on their feet, cheering their hero. Holly trying to climb onto the mount. Good position now for Holly. Dalgiev doing well by keeping upright. He's going to try and stand up now. He Holly tries needs to, to kick pull. the legs, he does, he kicks the leg out. Tries to pull Dalgiev back from the ropes. He's gonna work for the guillotine. He gets and it. And it looks tight. He can push him up against the ropes. Can he finish from here? Oh, look at how tight that is. Incredibly tight guillotine choke submission. He's got the arms trapped, he's got both arms trapped as well. But Dalgiev oh! survives again. Now and now goes for Dalgiev guillotine himself. Turned. What a back and forth fight! Oh, jumps to side control. Christian Holly knows where he is. Top position a people, now. A lot of people would have panicked in that situation. Now no, Holly is a seasoned veteran. Now he goes again oh, for the guillotine. Out. Went for side control guillotine. What a battle! 30 seconds left to go, Mark. What a crazy first round, Ian. Guillotine attempt again by the Brit. I think this will be a battle of, of will more than battle of skills and... 
and fitness. Yeah, both fighters obviously very well rounded. Now it's Stalyev going for the guillotine again, and this looks very, very tight here. Oh, heads out. His heads out. Eight seconds to go in that oh, first mounted. round. We're going to take a lot of finishing with one second left. But finish is strong. What a We're set for round two. I can't wait. Oh, clipped him. Holly goes for the takedown. Holly working that single, attacking the right leg of Dalgiev with his knee strikes. Dalgiev defending well. Holly could switch to a, a high clutch if he wanted to. The right hand. Oh, he pulls that leg out beautifully. Well done by Holly, but Dalgiev tries to stand up immediately. Now it's Dalgiev who grabs the uh, ropes. Yeah, Dalgiev needs to be careful because he is, he is going to get a point deducted. Almost. Take the back. Oh, he goes high, but he gets the hook in. Now this is tight. This is very tight. Oh, Perfectly nice defense. Transition. Nice defense. Perfect transition to that rear naked choke. needs to grab that leg with his... And I think he's Dalgiev squeezing, is going to He's squeezing. Dalgiev is going to tap. Very close, very close. That's better position, he's flattened him out. Dalgiev just doesn't want to give up in front of his hometown crowd here in Nazran Ingushitia. Holly could switch the palm to palm, that would work better. Slide his hand back, go palm to palm and get a better grip. That is a deep rear naked choke here. Holly's arms will probably be pumped right now. He's tried all the guillotines, he's tried to rear naked a few times. Yeah, Holly's expending a lot of energy here. Dalgiev survives once again, at least for now. That's the palm to palm now. Still That's in a better bad position. position here. That's stronger. Switches it to rear naked choke, figure four. Again wow. he defends. What a hard, what a hard by Kamsa Dalgiev who escapes again and now has the back of Holly. And Holly is devastated here. Expanded loads of energy on that choke. The referee's watching his hands. He's watching those hands. He doesn't want to get another point deducted. Because, like you see, he might have won the first round, but not with that point deducted. That point deducted. Exactly. That, we forgot about the yellow card. Yeah, so. that point deducted could mean it's at, at, at the very best a draw. For the worst for him, he's lost the round. And he's losing the second as well. Takedown by Dalgiev. Beautifully done, and now he's raining down punches. Referee's going to step back. in. The referee's going to step in. He needs to do something quick. I think he's exhausted. You have to intelligently defend yourself. The referee will not allow you to take punishment, even if it's bouncing off the arm. Holly doesn't have the gas tank to defend himself anymore. Now it's Dalgiev going for the really a job. More of a neck crank right now. Yeah, he's safe. Dagev needs to slip his forearm under the chin of Holly. But still, great position here for the English Egypt fighter. This is underneath now. Oh, this is T-Tap. And he tapped. -tap. And he tapped. Wow. What a win. What a win. Wow. I told you it was a... And it was a battle, that was a battle of will. Had nothing to do with fitness. Had nothing to do with the skill level. That was a battle of will. Who oh. wanted it more? Hold the arena on its he feet wanted now. It more. Not a single spectator sitting. Wow. What a fight. What an incredible fight. And we see Christian Ali here, obviously devastated. What a devastating victory for the Brit, who looked very good in the beginning. But at the end, the bigger heart prevailed. And we see Kamsa Dalgiev and his cornerman. Obviously in great spirits after such a big, big victory in front of his whole crowd. Best fight I've seen in a long time. What a finish. Here is Ian with the official decision.
Ladies and gentlemen, after three minutes, 14 seconds of round two, we have a winner due to tap out from rear naked choke, Kamzad Dalgiev! Kamzad Dalgiev, Respublika! Kamzad, дорогой! Ты сегодня совершил маленькое чудо для всех своих земляков. Они невероятно счастливы сегодня и рады за тебя. Ну что, скажешь пару слов? Первое слово, альхамду Хочу поблагодарить всех от души. Баракалла. Спасибо. Новых сил, новых побед. Хамзат Алгиев, Россия, Ингушетия.